Attention vendors, would you like to do business with the state of New Jersey? If so, welcome to NJ Start, the state's electronic procurement system. What exactly is NJ Start? NJ Start stands for New Jersey State of the Art Requisition Technology and replaces the previous legacy systems EBID and MACSE providing a one-stop solution that focuses on the complete procurement process lifecycle, from notification to proposal submission through contract award, NJ Start is designed to improve your procurement experience. There are two things you need to know about NJ Start. All vendors seeking to do business with the state must register using NJ Start. You must ensure your NJ Start vendor profile is in good standing. In the past, bidders were required to complete and submit forms with each proposal. With NJ Start, you can update your profile in advance, and in some cases, you may not be required to complete a form at all. With NJ Start, the procurement process is shorter, faster, and better. To get started with the registration process, just go to njstart.gov. Once you're on the site, click on the Register button Fill out your company's basic information and add someone to be the administrator of your company's profile. This is also where you'll be able to create a unique login ID. And remember to save and continue before you move on to each tab in the registration process. You will see four mandatory questions in the Categories and Certifications tab that must be answered to complete the registration process. The answers you provide will ensure that when the time comes, you will get paid promptly. Next, you will see several form requests and certifications. Some of these can be completed now, or you can return to them in the future when you're ready to submit a bid. You can skip the set of certifications that are grayed out since they'll be populated by other state systems of record. These include a Vendor's New Jersey Business Registration Certificate, New Jersey Affirmative Action Equal Employment Opportunity Certificate, insurance, and other requirements. You will not be able to enter certification information, but you should ensure that the information is accurate. If there's an issue with one of these certifications, NJ Start provides a link where you can take corrective action. Keep in mind, if you don't resolve the certification issues, you may not be able to contract with the state. Now you have to select at least one NIGP commodity code. If you need help finding one, use the NIGP class drop-down list, or just add a word that best describes your product or service in the NIGP keyword field, and hit search. At this point, you've completed your registration. Just check the summary page to make sure everything is accurate. Then, click the Complete Registration button. NJ Start will then send you a system-generated email that contains a temporary password. This is used with your login ID to perform a first-time login with the site. If you need more detailed instructions, download the Vendor Quick Reference Guides, which are available on the NJ Start Vendor Support page. Okay, let's recap. All vendors seeking to do business with the state must use NJ Start. Registration is quick and easy. You must ensure your vendor profile is in good standing. And remember, NJ Start is designed to improve your procurement experience. The opportunity to do business with New Jersey starts here.